Hi friends. I bought a thing from Instagram and I wanted to show you. Normally I fall for Instagram ads and end up with something really crappy. Um, but this time, this time we have a winner. Um, this is the True Cut My Comfort Cutter from Made by Grace. Um, and it is an ergonomic rotary cutter that is designed with your like natural wrist alignment in line um in mind so basically it, it kind of gets gripped into your hand like this so that it makes for easy cutting so i wanted to show you today um how this is used so that you can you know judge for yourself if this is something that you want to buy I want to say in the Instagram ad, um, it did include a coupon and I want to say it was maybe like less than $20, um, for me to purchase. I think it was like 15 maybe. Um, I don't remember, but I know it was cheap enough where I was like, yeah, it's a no brainer. I'm going to try it. So usually I use something like this. This is my baby. This is my favorite cutter in the whole wide world. I love this thing. I use it for so much, but I have fibromyalgia and when I'm in a fibro flare, even if I'm not, and I'm cutting a lot, um, it's just really painful. So um, I'm hoping this helps solve part of my problem that I'm having. Okay, so let me just kind of walk you through the components of this. Okay, so this is the cutter itself. It has a blade. It has a... Um, blade guard which is this black piece you can disengage the blade guard by pressing that little slider up and down the back part there is a button that releases the blade in um, this little pin so you can change out the blade so it's a quick change blade <laughs> sort of <laughs> um, I've had some instances where it comes right off when I you know press the button and other times where I just need to tug a little bit to kind of release it, like help release it. So, eh. um, but overall it's really easy to change. It also comes with these two pieces. There is this little black piece and a pin. So this is actually a ruler guard and I'll show you what that does because I didn't realize that it had that and I'm very excited and I'm probably never going to take this off of this cutter. <laughs> so let me show you quickly how this is used. So this is just a piece of waterproof canvas. So I just grab something random. So I'm going to disengage the guard. I'm going to place my thumb on the side, my finger up here. So you're just kind of like gripping it, however it feels natural. You can use a few fingers up here, one finger. I'm not sure how I'm going to feel the most comfortable using this over time. I have a feeling I might need to do two. Um, we'll see. We'll see what, what's comfortable for me. So very, you apply very light pressure and you know you can cut however you want to cut it um, and I mean I'm barely pressing down and it's cutting really really nicely so it doesn't really take a whole lot for you to just quickly cut pieces um, of material so super easy so I'm going to put my guard back so I don't cut myself I'm gonna disengage my blade. Let's see if this works. <laughs> sometimes it does, sometimes it doesn't. It did. Okay, so just grab your blade very carefully with your fingers and put this to the side. Now you're gonna grab your guard and the bigger pin, okay? Sorry, the guide and the bigger pin. So this is the um, ruler guide. And then you have this large pin. The pin goes inside. This goes into the top part. Snap it together. So what you're gonna do is you are going to disengage this, um, the guard, and you're gonna cut. Okay, so let me put that back for a second so I don't cut myself. So here is how you should use it. So line up your ruler, move your guard out of the way, and you're gonna place the blade right up against the edge of the ruler and this plastic black ruler guide is going to lay on top of the ruler. So it's going to roll right along with the cutter. So again, I'm just going to apply very light pressure. Okay, so it's, I mean, I'm barely, and again, 
um, your blade just goes right up against the ruler and the plastic part is on top and barely apply pressure. So it's just enough to kind of, you know, get the blade moving is the amount of pressure you're, you're applying. I'm probably applying more pressure with this hand to hold the ruler in place than I am on the blade. Oh, I didn't, I think, put it in the right place, so it didn't cut all of it. Hold on. Hold on one moment. There we go. Um, so it, it glides along really, really smoothly. I can cut pretty quickly, right, without fear of not, you know, following a straight line. So I think I'm gonna use this ruler guide like forever. I'm probably never gonna take it off. Here's the only issue I have with the guide. So let me show you. So because the guide um, jets out from the blade, what ends up happening is when you try to use this as any old rotary cutter to like cut out a shape, let's say, or a pattern piece, you can't see where the blade is. So when, when you have it down like this, this is in, in the way of your sight line. So you can't see where you're cutting. So you would have to switch it out to this to be able to see where you're cutting, which I think is a pain, but I mean, it's not the end of the world, right? So you're, you're I mean, it is pretty easy to change everything out. You know, I wanna put this back in, fine. You know, I disengage my guard and then I'm on my way, right? And I can start to cut out whatever I want, you know, and I can see where I'm going. Um, so that's the only downside to this, but I think otherwise it's a pretty cool tool and you don't need to put a whole lot of pressure. So, you know, I really think it's gonna save my hands because if you see the way that you would hold this, you're holding it where it's pretty, like kind of like level and straight when you're cutting. You're not having to bend your arm. You're, you're leaving it pretty much like this when you're cutting, because you're cutting, the, because the blade is kind of coming down from your hand. Um, you're not having to bend anything. When I'm using a rotary cutter like this, I'm having to kind of bend down and angle my arm slightly like this. So over time, when I'm doing this motion is what hurts me. <laughs> so, um, and I have to apply a little more pressure on these than I do with this because this is actually just a downward motion. And I think the way that, um, I'm not a, a science person necessarily, but the way that, you know, you are kind of putting that pressure in the way that that pressure is going straight down to the blade makes it a lot easier to push the blade along rather than when you're having your arm bent and having to, you know, the way you're having to position it and position that, that power behind it. So I definitely recommend this. Definitely check them out on Instagram and see if you get served up an ad so you can get a discount code. Um, otherwise, you can buy this from their website. I'm sure Amazon and all these other places probably sell it too. I just don't know if you're gonna get a cheaper price that way. I want to say that I looked before I bought it, but I don't recall like where I looked to see if I can get it cheaper. Um, but I definitely think it's worth the investment. This is the 45 millimeter version. They have a smaller version of this that I think is like a 25 millimeter, I think is the next one down. That's what I normally use to cut like pattern pieces is the smaller one. So I might go ahead and go to their website, pay full price, which I hate, but um, for the smaller version, if I can't find a coupon code um, to get it cheaper, because I think it is gonna be worth it for me just to kind of save my hands when I'm cutting out pattern pieces and everything else that I do. Um, if you um, just wanna go straight to their website to go look and see what they have, they have another color. I think they have a, I think there's a, there's a lavender, but again, not, on, not at the sale price um, or the discount price. Um, let me look for their website. It's here. It's www.graceframe.com. So graceframe.com, G-R-A-C-E-F-R-A-M-E.com is their website. So definitely check them out. Um, I'm not sure if they're also running like um, TikTok ads, but you might want to check there too, just to see if they'll serve you up an ad so you can get a discount code on this um, and check it out for yourself. Um, I will report back if I find that I'm not entirely happy with this or 
if I just love this thing more than life itself. Um, and I'll let you all know what I think. But um, I just got it today, so I'm just kind of playing around with it. Uh, so we'll see. Um, I cut a lot of waterproof canvas. I cut a lot of cotton woven, um, especially cotton woven interfaced, um, and a lot of vinyl, different thicknesses of vinyl, um, probably up to like marine vinyl. So um, I will let you know like how it does with those materials as well. I think this is going to be a game changer for me, especially when I'm in a lot of pain. And it can possibly even prevent me from, you know, um, hurting myself more often. So we will see, but enjoy. I hope you, um, were able to kind of see how this works and, you know, think about other ways that you can try to protect yourself if you do have chronic pain like I do. Um, so this is just one of the many tools out there. I would love to hear in the comments if you have found any other tools that have been beneficial to you if you deal with chronic pain, because I need them all. So let me know in the comments. Thanks so much. Bye.